We all are international students. Uh, some are from Nepal, some are from Ethiopia, some are from uh, Afghanistan. And this is our uh, international students hostel. It's been more than six months, uh, seven months we have been staying in this hostel. Uh, from the, right from the starting, we are facing various problems over this hostel. Uh, being a student, we just went, uh, we talked patiently, we talked calmly, we addressed, uh, we tried to address our problems to all the seniors, uh, faculties over here. But every time we did that, they said, write in one later and give it to us. And we did that. But Unfortunately, no serious actions were taken. Uh, before we had some problems about the room allocation, later on, after some month period, it was solved. But now we are ended up with water facilities. Uh, because of the water facilities, we can't even go to bathroom, which is a very basic need for every humans. I mean, we even quite dirty. Yes, uh, we even couldn't cook our food. We had to order from uh, uh, hotels we are not so wealthy enough to order every single day from the hotels our foods you know so uh, right now again we went to the chief warden it's been I guess one month new chief warden has been recruited but we haven't seen him yet right now also we called him so please come right now here and we want to talk with you about talk, talk with you about your problem and uh, he didn't receive the call uh, thrice he received the call but he didn't speak to me to me to us so it's too much now we students can't tolerate it so we are called the media to uh, we have called you people uh, not only water they even have given us cotton over there you can see we have pasted some newspapers on the walls and in f and the opposite of this hostel there is gauze hostel uh, and so because of that we feel a little shame and we have done all those newspaper activities they have not given us cotton and uh, because of you know there are many lots of things to be told but in words yeah, it's miss. quite we less so we just request uh, if anybody can do anything about this problem because i don't think now au people do anything they are so irresponsible you can see later on that they uh, in the video that they even tried to fight with us we were just going there to tell our problem and they just try to attack us and this is continuing not only the chief ward and even the vc our respected vice chancellors are also don't give such uh, you know very good response towards our problem so we all the students from international hostels do request you people uh, to 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 try to if you could do anything to try to solve our problems and more thing is uh, before coming to this place, we were asked to stay only two people in one room. We have to share only two people. And right now we are uh, sharing three people and some students are even sharing four students. You know, in one room they are staying four, four students. And it's very, very difficult for us to stay four students at a room. Uh, they haven't even put net in the windows because of that. Uh, two of my friends also, they were caught by dengue. And this is a very serious issue, but you know, they are so they are showing so reckless behavior that now it's too much for us.